before we continue with the rest of the video, we could use your help. Click the like button to help spread word about Watch Jojo Animals, and also be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss our future videos. This woman created a special space under the stairs for her dog, and it's genius. Harry Potter hated living in a cupboard beneath the stairs when he stayed with his aunt and uncle. If it had been something like the one belonging to Pancho the dog, however, he might never have left. Indeed, Pancho's human made him the perfect home within a home, and it's everything a dog or a lover of cute things could wish for. Four-year-old Chihuahua Pancho truly is a doted on doggo, and you can't fault his humans for her dedication. The human in question is Betty McCall, an ex-teacher who lives in Rochelle, Georgia. When McCall's husband, who has sadly since passed away, took Pancho home, the dog was suffering from an illness. To be more precise, the Chihuahua had canine parvovirus, or parvo, as it's sometimes called. Parvo is contagious between dogs and gets passed on through feces. The disease attacks the heart or intestines of the sufferer, and if it goes unchecked, the results can be fatal. In fact, the death rate for parvo is as high as 90% if it goes undiagnosed. Pancho was in good hands, however. That was because McCall's daughter worked as a veterinarian. Thanks to her, Pancho was cared for throughout his illness until he recovered. When Pancho was fit and healthy again, his mommy obviously thought he deserved to be pampered in a big way. He's terribly spoiled, McCall told ABC News in September 2016. Pancho now lives on a cotton farm with his brother and sister, Pete and Pushy. Pete is an Australian shepherd dog and Pushy's a cat, but the three get along famously. He felt comfortable around his family, but Pancho had some anxiety issues around crowds. Pancho gets really nervous when there's a lot of people, McCall explained. So I always had a dog crate so he'd have somewhere to go and calm down when people were over. But when McCall moved to the farm, a crate wasn't good enough for Pancho. As Will Rigdon, McCall's nephew, discovered, while visiting his aunt's house for the holidays, he stumbled on Pancho's doggy digs. He was so impressed that he uploaded the pictures to social media. Under the username Fantisback, Rigdon shared the photos of Pancho's pad on Imgur. The pictures showed that, with the intention of giving Pancho someplace he could feel at ease, McCall had created a perfect Chihuahua chill space. When I built this home, I thought I'd have a place rather than a dog crate, McCall told ABC News, so I asked my carpenters to build this for me. Pancho's Potter-like pad was inserted under the stairs, secreted behind a door built into a wall. It has a big door that opens, and it has a little door with a screen on it. My carpenters also put in the walls with acrylic flooring, Pancho's mommy explained, but those weren't the only comforts the Chihuahua would enjoy for his room. Next came the American Girl bed, a treasure that McCall dug up at a thrift shop. It classed up Pancho's room far beyond its $4 price tag and looked adorable to boot. Suddenly, the stair space looked a lot more like a home than a hidey hole. The canine comforts multiplied from there. A state sale provided Pancho with a delightfully dainty chest of drawers, though he needs help moving the furniture. And the decor only got better once the rest of McCall's family saw what she'd done with the place. My sisters came and they really wanted everyone in my county to think I was crazy, McCall mused. McCall mused. Carol decided that he needed a sombrero and a little pair of antlers over his bed. My other sister, Gail, made a lamp and a rug for his room. Pancho certainly wasn't complaining, though. He seemed to love his new doggy decorations, especially when the food and water bowls were added. The canine connoisseur even got treated to some tiny oil paintings. His favorite is surely the one of the dogs playing poker. But the piece de resistance has got to be Pancho's piano. It's where the Chihuahua's only house rule originates. I found it at another yard sale, McCall said. I told him he could have it as long as he doesn't play it at midnight, she joked. Pancho isn't left out when it comes to holiday celebrations either. His human mommy has decorated the dog's dig several times for festive events, including Halloween. It's the one time of the year where Pancho's place has something in common with Harry Potter's. And that thing in common would be spiders, of course. For the scariest night of the year, the Chihuahua's room underwent a terrifying transformation into a cave of lost hope. Well, some pumpkin decorations and spider webs were added, at least. Election Day was also the time for celebration in Pancho's pad. Pancho wouldn't say who he voted for, but his new decorations gave it all away. His little light shade was replaced by a tiny campaign poster pushing Pancho for president. He'd get our vote. This amazing custom-made canine cave was entirely decorated with crafts and thrifty finds. Pancho ended up with quite a room, McCall told ABC News. He doesn't really touch anything in there except his bed, 
but he thinks he deserves it all, so I guess it's okay. We certainly can't argue with that. Please don't forget to share this video with your friends below. Please do not forget to subscribe and activate the bell to receive everything that is new.